hey guys today we're doing a tutorial on a natural eyebrow look first of all you're gonna need an eyebrow pencil i use davis pencil in the number 40 i like it because it's not too dark it blends well with my eyebrows you're also gonna need concealer i use two shades espresso and cool tan both from pro concealer i usually mix them together just to achieve my skin tone or complexion you're also gonna need a spoolie yeah you're also gonna need a spoolie brush um any kind of brush really next you're gonna need a concealer brush it has to be super flat at the tip um you're also gonna need pressed powder or loose powder and a powder brush yeah so to start off uh, by using the powder on the eyebrows i just uh, get rid of any sort of product or oil so that the application of the brow pencil may be smoother yeah you just need like a little bit not really too much after you're done you now take your spoolie brush and brush your eyebrows upwards just to give um to give you space to line your brow We now go in with a brow pencil and guys make sure it's sharp enough. You start off with gentle strokes, not too far from the beginning of your eyebrows. And guys with eyebrows, um, you really need to be light handed, like don't put too much pressure. The aim is to make the brows look as natural as possible so we are sort of just filling it up. I know by now... <laughs> Um, you know the front part of the brow is supposed to be very dense on product so gentle strokes upwards is the technique you're gonna use to achieve that look yeah also go in uh, with a spoolie uh, just to remove excess eye pencil because we don't want it too dark One thing about me, I will sharpen my eye pencil, child. Make sure you do too. So now you're gonna line the upper brow. Remember, gentle strokes, guys. Also, I feel like groomed eyebrows are easier to work with. I personally use razor. I used to thread, then I stopped. I feel like razor works for me now. And you could also just quickly do it yourself in case you need like grooming. See, you can't even tell the difference. I basically just filled the brows. I didn't even draw them. <laughs> so now it's time to conceal. I already placed the shade Cool Tan on my palm because I'm an artist, lol. <laughs> I'm just gonna mix the, the shade Espresso so that the concealer won't be too bright or too dark. I usually go in with very little product because I don't want like it to look funny because I'm not planning to do any heavy makeup. It's a natural look. So I like to lift my eyebrow at the edge just for easier application. It sort of gives you allowance to glide smoothly. 
so i begin with the front part again be very light-handed and gentle take your time guys concealing is the most important part of the eyebrow grooming so i like to take the product downwards as i apply because it dries too fast and i like a thin layer of concealer especially at the front part of the brow as i get to the arc i feel like i have already set a foundation so i glide my brush smoothly to the tail of the brow just as you can see yeah and again take the product downwards to the rest of the eyelid i just go in smoothly like to make sure the line is really really straight You could add more concealer just to sharpen the outer corners. So now I just dab the rest of the products onto my eyelid. Then I'm gonna go in with a fluffy brush and continue to blend the rest of the product on my skin. When concealing the upper brow, I usually take the spoolie brush and stroke the hair downwards because I don't want to overline since it's a very natural looking brow. You want to maintain the same size or shape. So I'm going in with a shade espresso because that's my complexion. If you use foundation, that's what uh, you could go for. Yeah. Again, use little to no product when you're lining the upper brow, especially if you're not going to put on foundation. So I'm going to remove excess product from my concealer brush and take a very little amount of the shade Espresso to line my upper brow. It needs to look almost invisible, guys. Like it's just supposed to blend with your skin. So now go in with a fluffy brush to blend in, to blend the product in. Then go in with a spoolie brush to get off any excess product. I like to hold it at the tip because it sort of gives me um, enough control. See, you can't even tell the difference between the two brows. They look almost similar. Wow, 
So now we go in with a pressed powder and dab just to pre prevent creasing during the day and also remove excess product since I'm not wearing any foundation. Now on to the next brow. I usually start off by measuring using the brow I have already done. As you can see, I draw a very light line connecting the two of them. Don't worry, we'll conceal it later. Don't forget to hold your eyebrow up at the edge, guys. It's so helpful, I promise. And always 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 sharpen your pencil as you go um very essential <laughs> So we're just gonna repeat the same process, the same process of concealing, yeah? Now I don't know if y'all are like me. One side of my eye is always so problematic. In my case, it's this side, like my hand just fumbles like real bad. Even when I'm doing eyeliner, like one side is always just, ah. Look, I already made a mess. <laughs> Yo. But don't worry. You could always just go in with the eye pencil and fix it. Like guys, never feel the urge of making your eyebrows identical. Twins. They could be sisters, yeah. Just sisters. But not cousins. Cousins is where we draw the line. That's a big no. At least try and make them look related. <laughs> if that makes sense, yeah? I'm basically just doing the same thing I did on the other side of the eyebrow. Guys, I'm no makeup pro or artist. I'm just doing what works for me, honestly. Yeah. 
also i'm sorry about the lighting or the quality of my video i'm recording on an android phone but stick around it's gonna get better soon inshallah like everything is a learning process and um, yeah i'm driving the point home tell me if i'm helping you guys down in the comment below like are you digging are you understanding am i educating you yeah i hope this video was helpful thank you so much for watching um please like comment subscribe and share this video i love you guys so 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 much um thank you so much for engaging with my content tell me what you'd like to see me do down in the comment below i would really appreciate yeah so guys just watch as i finish up this eyebrow look see you in the next video i guess love and light Period.